Hey everybody and welcome back to Misfit Corner Scams. This is CR's News Andrew speaking and it's time for another scam call. I get a lot of comments from time to time where people will say, you're being too nice, you're being too nice to them. And honestly, I'm only trying to get the, keep the call going, you know? If I start to be mean to them right away, it doesn't always end very well. This one, I got mean pretty much almost right away because this, this person, this caller, was infuriating. And I just started unloading because, I mean, not bad. I mean, I wasn't cursing up a storm or anything. But I definitely told them how much of an idiot I thought they were. And the best part was they transferred me to somebody else who I could do the same thing to. <laughs> anyway, I do I do lose my cool some from time to time. I mean, I mean, everybody does, right? But sometimes these people, they deserve it. Anyway, this is a Medicare scam call, and if you like the content, like and subscribe. We do daily videos, daily shorts, and we live stream on Saturday nights at 8 p.m. Eastern Time. We get together, we chit-chat, we talk about, you know, whatever, scams, and uh, we have a good time doing Q&A, so join us. Thanks a lot for checking out the video. This is Alexa, and I am calling you from Medicare head office. How are you doing today? Very good. Oh, that's great. Actually, the reason of my call is let you know your new Medicare card is ready for the shipping and you will receive after two days at your home residing address and your doorstep. First of all, confirm me, do you have your red, white and blue Medicare card, the old one? Uh, well, yes, I, I have the red, white and blue one, but you say I'm getting a new card? Yes, sir, I just told you your old Medicare card is going to expire and we are providing you a new Medicare card right now. Okay. So it's a verification call by your side. If you don't mind, I can hold on. You can just go and grab your old Medicare card. I really appreciate you. So what's the difference between the new one and the old one? Sir, it's a recorded line, so I just need your old Medicare ID, so then we are sending you a new Medicare card. Okay. And your new Medicare number is different of the old card. Oh, so it's going to be a whole new number then? Sorry? You said it's going to be a whole new number? The number's changing? Yes. Oh, okay. Yes. Well, I hadn't heard that. What else is different about the new card and the old card? I can hold on for you. You can go and grab your Medicare card. Oh, yeah, I've, I've got it, but I'm I just really asking can. these questions because this is important. What else okay. is what else is different about the new card and the old card? Um, sir, your new Medicare ID number is different, and your old Medicare ID number is different. So that's why I talk, I'm talking about your Medicare ID number. So can you, I can hold on for you. You can go and grab it. Oh, I have it. I have it right now. I was just asking you a question, uh, okay. so, so, can it, so you still can haven't answered. The numbers? You still haven't answered sir, my question, have, though. Sir, your new Medicare ID number is two a number, be like in Paul, you like an umbrella for a number, and the middle three is K like in Kite, eight a number, ninth a number, and the last four is C like in George, S like in Henry. Four four. It's your new Medicare ID number. That's the new I one. Your old Medicare okay. ID number. Yes. Okay. So when should I when should I get this new card? So sir, can you read me the numbers which is appear on your card just below your name, and then we are sending you a new Medicare card. That's it. Okay. And when should I expect to get the new card? I I need to be on the lookout for it, right? You will you will receive after two days, sir. Two days. Okay. Yes. And what address do you have for me? Um, just a second. Oh, okay, okay. Just make sure you're sending it to the right address. Sir, can you read me the numbers? Well, what address do you have? Let me make sure you have the right address first. Okay, just a second. Oh, okay, no problem. And I and I don't think you ever asked me my name. So what name are you? Do you have there? Oh, listen to me. Just hold on. Oh, okay, okay. I'm holding on. Um, your first name is spelled like J E N N I F, right? It's what? Um, just a second. Okay. 
Um, sir, your first name is James, right? James, is that what you have? Yes. Okay, Spitzler, right? Sorry? Spitzler is my last name. Is that what you have? What? what oh my you god, this is like pulling teeth. Hello, is there somebody else there I can talk to? You obviously don't get um, it. Um, sir, or listen to me. Your last name is spelled like S P I T L E R, right? Yeah, let me talk to somebody else, please. You're an idiot, and I can't stand talking to you anymore. Sir, your home residing address is Hello? 304. Hello? Yes, knock, I knock. Am. McFly, do you hear me? Let me talk to somebody else. You're an idiot, and I don't want to talk to you anymore. Hold on. Yes, please. Tired of listening to you talk. Hello? Hello, who's this? I'm Janet. My name is Janet Wilson and I'm a senior supervisor here. Oh, thank goodness. That person I was talking to before, I don't know if you get a lot of complaints about her, but she is a freaking idiot. I was asking her very simple questions and instead of answering them, she just kept on talking. Kept on talking. I'm so sorry. I mean, I'm come really on. Sorry. This I'm is so this sorry. is this is the dumbest conversation I've ever had with Medicare. You know, you people. I don't know who you're employing, but you're doing a horrible job. Uh, no, no, I'm not employed. I'm a Medicare agent. Um, you are. My name is Janet Wilson, and my BHID number is two one nine zero zero. I'm a senior supervisor here. Your senior supervisor. Uh, okay. Yes. And where are yes. you guys out of? Medicare. What city and state are you guys out of? It's the Washington, D.C., sir. You're in Washington, D.C.? Yes. Really? Then why does my phone show it? You're calling from a 904 area code, which that's not Washington, D.C. Why are you lying to me? Sir, it's Washington, D.C. Yeah, bull crap. Bull crap. That 904 is not a Washington, no, D.C. area code. Sir, Stop sir. lying. Calm Stop down, lying. Sir. You're in Calcutta or Dubai or someplace like that. Bull crap. You're a me you're as much a Medicare agent as I'm a I'm a rock star. Hey, I could be a rock star. Yeah, I know. Hey everybody and thanks a lot for checking out the video. If you like the content, click the subscribe button and hit the bell for notification. Leave us a comment. Let us know what you think. Thumbs up, thumbs down, either way. And we'll catch you all next time.